We're sharing three different tree setups today and we'll be giving you our tips for trimming the tree. Start with a pretty tree and a good base. Here we did a linen tree skirt. Add in garland. You can layer in multiple types of garland to create dimension. Here, we started with a large washed garland that's chunky and added in a neutral wood tone with a variation of bead sizes, and then added in a really small gold beaded garland that dresses it up a little more. Add in a foundation of repetitive, solid color palette ornaments. This really helps keep the tree feeling unified by carrying something consistent throughout the tree. Mix in your unique shapes and special textures. Tie ribbons to help carry through your palette. Top it all off with a star. In our second look, we carried the same tips through but changed it a little bit to create a more neutral aesthetic. We blended the more glam textures with natural materials, a mix of woven, wood, solids, mixed metals, and texture, and finished it off with a different ribbon. We have a kid's tree. It's a tree that the kids get to decorate in the loft next to their rooms. It's a fun thing for us. We did it last year, and quite a few of you do something similar. For this look, we also wanted to share that we use gift wrapping paper as another way to incorporate the color palette. Our kids' tree is to showcase sentimental ornaments they've made throughout the years and ornaments I've had since childhood. 